prophecies would seem to kind of merge them together, uh, the first and the second coming of Christ. I mean, take Isaiah chapter 11. It talks about Jesus being this sort of stump of Jesse and the spirit of the Lord is upon him. And uh, and, it, and it speaks of just seeming like his earthly ministry, but then it flows straight into what occurs at his second coming and the lion and the lamb will lay down next to each other and like it's going to be this unprecedented peace and all of this. Mm -hmm. And so I can imagine somebody saying, well, hey, this is just the way biblical prophecy works. I mean, mm -hmm. take Isaiah chapter 11. It talks about Jesus being this sort of stump of Jesse and the spirit of the mm -hmm. Lord is upon him. And uh, and, it, and it speaks of just seeming like his earthly ministry, but then it flows straight into what occurs at his second coming and the lion and the lamb will lay down next to each other and like it's going to be this unprecedented peace and all of this.